So you know, in recent times, this thermal gun has become a very, very popular device which you will find in all public spaces. Anywhere you go, you will find somebody noting down your temperature using this device. And recently, the Delhi government has issued a notice that this device is essential outside all schools. No student can enter school premises without being monitored for their body temperature. How does it work exactly? And how accurate is it? We're going to tell you what this thermal gun is all about. So, you know, body temperature is a very clear-cut giveaway sign for COVID symptoms. It's the first thing you would want to check while interacting with anybody coming from outside. This gun comes in handy. Why? Because A, it reads your temperature very quickly and secondly, it can note your temperature without having any physical contact with the object or with the subject. So, basically, when you point this at a subject or a human body, how is it noting the temperature? You see, this device is mainly made up of three things. There is a laser, there is a converging lens, and then there is an IR sensor inside it. All these three will come together to represent the temperature in digital format, which will be visible on the screen which you have behind it. Now, as soon as the gun is pointed towards a body, there is a laser which helps pinpoint where it needs to mark the temperature from. Now, coming to the mechanics of it, first of all, it is pointed towards a human body. Now, to just explain to you, every human body has a certain amount of thermal radiation which is emitted from it. The laser in this device is used to pinpoint towards the human body. Then the infrared sensor in this device will read the amount of radiation being emitted, the thermal radiation being emitted from the human body. That through the converging lens is then read by a thermopile. Thermopile is basically a device which helps to convert thermal energy into electrical energy. And after that, the temperature is represented on the digital screen. Is it harmful to use on kids? Well, scientifically, various experts have suggested that this statement is incorrect because the thermal gun only measures with infrared radiation that is reflected at all times by all objects around us, including human bodies. It does not use radioactive beams such as X-rays, only infrared. Thermometer guns are also FDA approved. It functions automatically. It is touchless, which is the need of the hour, and it functions automatically. It just requires you to press one button. It detects the temperature of the person from a range of 5 to 10 centimeters. Now, these thermal guns are useful because essentially they are quick. Temperature readings are obtained at a much quicker pace than traditional methods. Using a temperature gun reduces the risk of cross-contamination and spreading disease due to its non-contact approach. It is the safest bet at the moment. Now, are they accurate? Now, talking about the accuracy of this device, if we were to consider a traditional thermometer which you would place in the mouth to note body temperature, usually 98.4 degrees Celsius is considered normal. But when you are noting temperature using this device, a degree or two lesser than that is also considered normal. 98.4 in this device would mean fever. Other than that, how accurate this device is, well, there needs to be more study on it. It cannot be considered as a conclusive evidence of whether you are infected with COVID or not or whether you have fever or not. But yes, it does help you get a decent idea about what your body temperature is. For more informative videos like this, keep watching India Today News Mode.